Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mobby, and today we're going to try a game called Two Room. Two Room is a dungeon crawler roguelike top-down shooter where the protagonist just wants to come back to his bedroom after waking up in a world of fantasy. Okay, so this game's on Steam, just came out July 17th, and it goes for $12 US. Um, this game says full controller support, but I have my controller plugged in, but it's not really... Oh, I have to press start on in the bottom right. Ah, that's interesting. All right, let's get started. Uh, single player. Yes, yes. <laughs> As usual, if you want to see my review of any game I play on there, head over to my main YouTube and please come by my Twitch. I live stream most days of the week. Normal? Oh, let's see what the difference is. Whoa, question marks? For those who want something more casual, less rooms, enemies have less health. Normal, and for those who want more challenges, enemies have 25% more health and more damage, bosses are more difficult. I wonder what they mean by more difficult. I better have new AI or just more difficult in general than just a stat boost, because that's always just lazy, right? Finish the game with no unexplored room and on hard mode to get this stuff. This seems like a pretty good game so far. Hmm, what's this, costumes? Maori, our dear protagonist, very resistant but with little mana. <gasps> so they have different abilities. Oh, how many other? One, two, three, four, five, six, uh, six. Brother and Maori's best friend has or Modi has less health than Modi, but has higher mana and mana rehen. Regeneration. Oh, let's give me see your print. So twin stick. What's this? Oh, play. Oh. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, B buttons a roll. Looks like there's a cooldown though. Wow, interesting, huh? Uh, all right, let's play. Whoa. Oh. All right, Modi. Once upon a time, there was a very happy bunny called Modi. Modi. One happy day, he was sleeping. Go on. <gasps> when an unknown entity got into his room and he captured him. Damn aliens. Let's go. And then Modi appeared in a completely unknown place. <gasps> Hoggers unknown. Whoa, slime. Now his goal is to go back to his room, fighting any enemy in his way. Whoa, let's go. Oh, okay, I'm here. I wonder if this is a roguelike. Roll while moving, you got it. How do I attack? I got an item. Maybe you always start with the treasure? What the hell did I just get? Roll. Oh. Oh, you just use the freaking stick and an auto attacks. Open inventory? Oh that's, oh, that's my map. Inventory. I have a sword. Regular sword. The game's first sword. Looks like there's 10 damage, 10, I don't know, with that crit chance or something. Uh, 34. What's that? Speed? 5.7.5. I don't even know what the hell those stats mean. Uh, Ruby necklace. Health potions heal twice as much. This feels like a roguelite. How's the value? Maybe I should turn it down just a little bit. We start bed controls. Aim, switch weapons, roll, interact, drop an in inventory. Okay, triangles to drop. Let's not accidentally do that. Interact and roll. Okay, I like it so far. You could have more than one. Drop weapon. Teleport. Oh, it's a teleporting bet. Oh, huh. oh, that's a potion. Maybe I wasted it. I got an achievement called Iceland Biome. I like the music. Oh, what the hell, dude? Ah. You have to do the Dark Souls claw if you want to freaking like use your stick and then dodge at the same time. Otherwise, you have to like get your thumb off the thing. Oh god, it's so weird. It's probably better on a freaking. Oh my god, my range, dude. My range. Yeah, you, you got the Dark Souls claw this thing. You guys know what I mean, right? So I'm using my index finger as like a claw motion. Oh god, let me just show you. Let me show you. So this is the claw thing I'm doing, like this. You gotta, you gotta have your your hand like this. Instead of going like, ah, oh, pew, pew, you gotta go like that. Weird, right? All right. This guy's, this guy's almost killed me already. Ah, oh, the potion heals twice as much, though. I wonder if that potion is always like a, like a, a thing there. All right. So far, so gooch. Give me those monies. I'll take all the money. And my range is really bad. Those are some interesting first enemies. I'm surprised, you know, this game doesn't have a, uh, like, numbers popping up to show you how much damage I do. I would really like that. I usually love, the, like, like that kind of uh, extra 
uh, statistic in games like these. This definitely does feel like it's just a straight roguelike, though. It's not that. That's not it. I love roguelites. One of my favorite genres. A lot of replayability. Oh, Mamma Mia. These skeletons. What do these guys remind me of? They remind me of, like, the Binding of Isaac enemies. I'll try to explore all the rooms here. Let's see. Yeah, I like the presentation so far. I think it's really cool. A lot of money. Are these always just money? So you gotta go near the things. Let me see if these things disappear. Let's see. Does it look like it's disappearing? I'll leave that one there. Let's see if it does the thing more in roguelites. If you leave an item on the ground, the map will show that it's still there. Let's see. It's still, yeah, it shows the treasure chest there still. So if I pick it up, it should be gone. Or maybe that was just a treasure room. Let's see if I leave. No, the treasure symbol still there. So maybe they don't show you. But yeah, that was probably just like a treasure room, I guess. Okay, these are the most dangerous enemies we've seen so far. Jesus. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> this game's pretty sweet. Ugh. Come on, man. Ow. Dude. Come on. My range is no bueno. Do -do 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 -do. Hmm. Hiya, hiya, hiya. Okay, let's go over here. Hiya! Oh, dark room. So there was another way back down there if I like look on the map. Yeah, see there's another area bottom left. I wanna go back over there. I wanna explore all the rooms. I want a new weapon. I wonder if my, my friend, I forgot his name. This is Modi, but his best friend. Why was his best friend sleeping with him? Are they adopted or something? And why am I a rabbit? Oh, flame boots. Oh. Oh, how does that work? Considerably increases your speed while invincible. So invincible, I mean maybe uh, iframes after I take damage. Flame boots. Okay, okay. I want to go back this way. <laughs> this music's tight. It's very quaint. It's a very quaint game. Hmm. I should have just like died early on to see what happens. But uh, we're vested in this run now, so. Hmm. Yes, I have so much money. These are like one each, huh? Yeah. Kia, kia. Yes. I spy on. Yeah. Let's see. Whoa, that's a lot of slimos. As long as I see, it looks a little dangerous, but you can see their shadows, right? As long as I stay away from the shadows, I should be good. Should be good. Is this? Is the, is the word here? How do I use my mana? I probably need a new weapon or something. Yeah. So far, we've only got the sword and the oh, eyeglasses. Increases your critical chance by 15%. Oh, you can see there in my book. Plus 15. Wonder why it doesn't just say 25. But I guess that shows you your base. That's interesting. Was that a larger chest than these tiny ones? Man, I wasn't paying attention. And what does this mean? Like, can I only have uh, 4, 8, 12 accessories? Huh. Maybe it's not that long of a game. You know, it's only 12 bucks, but, you know. Prices can be deceiving. Maybe it's just super well made, a lot of replayability, but, um, you know, they priced it decent. We'll see, though. Oh, you can see there, I think I'm critting. I think when the star pops up, that's a crit. If so, I'm critting quite a lot. Give me the money. Give me the money. Money, 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 money. Yeah. Why is the game called To Room? My name is Mon Monty. I tell up. Oh, I can go to the right. It's treasure room. Whoa, a shop? Hey, man. Who are you? 
Is there any weapon? Regular, that's a swan, swan, regular weapon. Blue cloak and a ice staff. I mean, it seems cool. The blue cloak. It's an accessory, right? Oops. After taking damage, there's a 20% chance of summoning portals that shoots enemies. Let's try this thing out. Oh, wow. It's just another weapon. So it loses up 1.8 mana, it seems. It does 15 damage. Seriously, what is the, the swords in the... It must be attack speed. Like, it's a little fast. It must be attack speed. But what does the punching on the right do? Is that knockback? A little slow, high knockback, and makes enemies slow. Yeah, the knockback. Okay. So how do you switch? R1. R1. Oh, I see. Do I have regen? Oh, my mana regen does go there. This is a regular weapon? I might as well try it. I got a lot of money. Okay, regular sword. Swone? So remember, the swone is 1034, 7.5. 1735, and let's see, 5. So my first one has better knockback. This one has a little bit faster speed, and it does more damage. This is the range of this one, and this is the range of the other one. It seems I have longer range too. So I guess if I um, if I ran out of mana, I can switch over to my stronger one. So there you go. That's sweet. <gasps> the boss? Oh no, it's like some weirdos. Jesus! Switch! Ow! Ow! Switch over. Knockback. Yeah. Yeah. Take that. Yeah, I think it's much more precise if you use a keyboard and mouse here, though. I'm slowing down. But I like using it. You know, whenever I try to like to use a controller. Some games, you just gotta use a keyboard and mouse. But here, you know, seems fine so far. Da -da -da -ba -do -ba -da. <gasps> yeah, with the longer range, I feel a lot more better using this weapon. But yeah, I guess... Infinite range. This is way more safer, though. I don't know if my HP has been increasing at all. Probably not. Oh, if you're out of mana, they sometimes drop mana pots. Oh, spear. Uh, I think it has longer range. Let's see. 1534. 15 and 34. 1736. So it's a little my, my my new weapon I bought's a little better. It's another shop? Wow. What the wait, these are like why are they glowing? Well were they always glowing? Or maybe these are cursed items? Mana flask. Oh. Your mana stays at the maximum if there are no enemies. What that seems weird. What? <laughs> hey man, magic sticks a weapon, and this is a regular weapon. It's a basic boomerang. No enemies? So my mana goes down. Oh, well, I don't know when I would, you know, when that would come in handy. Now, aren't I usually only only expending mana when the enemies are here? That's kind of weird, huh? I summoned portals when I got hit. Did you see that? Switch, switch when possible. Is the whole game one floor? It's a pretty long first floor if that's the case. Another one? Oh, it's a swone. Hey, one of the stats change up. 1736.5. Seven. No, it seems the same. Oh, oh well. Okay. Oh, mama mia. Let's see. Yo, I'm kind of hurt here though, huh? Gotta keep a moving. Got to move and twerk was we good to go. My god, they're really tanky, aren't they? Ah! You bitch. Alright, we're good. I'm just most excited to try out more artifacts. They're the most uh, interesting parts about, you know, most roguelites. They usually, uh, you know, change up how the game is played. It's awesome. What the hell? Did I not kill you guys or did they respawn? What is this? No, I definitely killed them. Maybe they respawn. Oh, there's a big room. Oh my god. I got my own portals. Look. <laughs> Owie, dude. Oh, my boots of speed is making me faster. 
or the flame boots. I don't know the name of these boots. Dude, look at the door. It's a boss door. All right. I'll definitely explore the rooms first, though. Man is at max when no enemies are near. <laughs> uh, we have no use for that yet. Maybe they're for solving puzzles or something. I don't know. Mana flask. Weird item. Another shop? Whoa. Whoa. Ice sword. Probably slows down enemies. Blue book? Hmm. This one costs a little more. Horseshoe. Horseshoe. Doubles the chance of enemies dropping equipment. So not just consumables, but equipment. Whoa. That's neat. Doubles the chance. What is the chance rate? All right, we kind of want to be full health for the boss. Hey, look, they dropped it. Dude, I already have that weapon. <laughs> Do they always drop specific weapons in this bio, maybe? Like ice sword, ice wand, what have you. It's just an ice stuff. Let me double check here. 25, 39, 15, 18, 29, 34. Yeah, okay, it's the same. I don't know. I think it's uh, interesting. Beauty, 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 beauty. I want to buy that other item because it seems to be another straight up uh, like uh, accessory. Because it doesn't say like magical weapon underneath or anything. All right, let's go down here. Uh, let's go down here. Uh. What up? Oh, that's a lot of enemies. All right, that's enough out of you. Yeah, suckers. Cat, 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 cat. Yaboosh. Whoa, what's that? Equipment. Oh, if they could drop accessories, this is a pretty good item. I don't see that enemy. It's a regular weapon? Okay, remember. 1736 and 5. Okay, a little weaker thing. Ah, interesting weapon. Um a little weaker i think we stick with this because we already have a long range weapon right it's fine 17 i mean 15 crit rate the crit rate's actually nice oh, i'll try this for a room there's two swords here yeah this isn't bad it seems to pierce if it hit one enemy and came back that would be lame right but this one is good it just takes a little bit longer to kill things because I can't like swing multiple times. But uh, yeah, it's not bad. Is that a soul man? Magical weapon? 2539, 1.8. That's a lot of damage. What's the damage? Oh, that's no, the speed. Snowman head. 9, 1.7. Ah. Uh, Nah, I don't know. They seem both good. I think I'll stick with this one. It's a little slower, but more damage. It's cool, though. Oh, snowmans. Yeah, it seems like all the items they're dropping seem to be kind of like for the biome, though, from what I can tell, right? I thought for sure the boomerang would like bring the items to me. <laughs> like if there's a consumable, I could use it. It doesn't seem to be the case. Look, it's another snowman. Slime Spear? 1534. 1842. It's not bad. 18 compared to 15. Hmm. It's not terrible, I'll tell you that. I think it, it is definitely better than the sword. The swan. But I'll, I'll still use uh, this, I guess. A little safer. I'll try for a room. I'll have to go back anyway, this way. What's that? A teleport? Look at this. It's so hard to hit the this thing right here. Look. Man. What the hell? Ah, a teleport bed. Let's see how this fears. Um, yeah, like I said, it's good reach. Attacks way faster, right? Hmm. I think the boomerang's probably better. Two swans. I should try the snowman for a head for a thing, too. You switch out things so easily in this game, huh? Y'all want some of this? Da -da 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 -da. Machine gun. <laughs> Machine gun, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, I think I like the boomerang and I like the wand better. I'll grab those when I can. God, look at. I can't even hit this thing. 
Can't wait to fight the boss. It's the last room. Y'all like snowman heads? Roll. I gotta get used to more rolling. Wait, what the hell? Is that a live tree? I think that's a live tree enemy. Is that an enemy? Can I hit it? I'm getting beat up here. Uh, I think there's like tree enemies that are really messing with me right now. But I, I don't know if they're like hazards or what. Uh, they're real enemies. I think... I don't know. I'm getting messed up here like really bad. Okay, they're real enemies. Okay, this room totally destroyed me. That's not... I'm gonna, I actually might just die here. Hope I don't. I want to see the boss. I gotta play. I gotta be more careful. Oh, I dropped that weapon. Should have played more safe. A blue cloak? Another one? Okay. I wonder if it stacks or if it's two 20% chances. Yeah, who knows? Who knows? Can I get an easy room so I can heal up? Oh, treasure. Health tonic. Increase the maximum health by 20. Oh, that's nice. I needed that. <laughs> I needed that. Hi, 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 hi. It's good for room, like, uh, you know, destroying the things. Because I have infinite mana. I have a lot of money, so let's go buy that book. Oh, my health isn't maxed out, but, you know, it is what it is, dude. Do -do 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 Need health? Please! Need health! How do I get missing these? Boomerang. Oh my god. I think enemies. What the hell is that? Yeah, enemies might come back. Or did I miss this room? I don't know. Oh my god, this weapon's so slow. But it's way safer. That's all the rooms. Enemies come back. So you can farm enemies, huh? For money? Money, and I guess they have a chance to drop health. They can get for health, too. Interesting. So that's an interesting mechanic for a roguelite, huh? Enemies respawn. After you've cleared the room out. I'm gonna buy this magic book. It's not supposed to be a weapon, right? Blue book. If you increase cooldown for mana regen by 50. Wait, so I regenerate crazy faster? Well, enemies know here, so. Alright, let's try fighting. Oh, there's a lot of stuff. I should leave that there. Santa Canta Sauce. <laughs> Canta Sauce. Whoa, the music. Oh! Oh, what the hell? Oh, that's not the real Santa. He's going through different portals. Okay, hold on, hold on. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's going through different portals. Okay, there's five portals. I gotta hit the real one. What are those slots, dude? This is cool. Ah! Mamma mia! Presence! Come on, man. Come on. Come on, man. Come on, Santa. It's so hard to hit him here because uh, he goes away so fast. I wonder if I'm supposed to just survive. Because I can't really hit him right now. Nah, that's good. That's good. That's a lot of damage. Oh, I wish I had the other weapon now, huh? Yeah, I'll, I'll just try to survive during the other the, the, the other attack. I need health. I'm getting beat up, dude. Oh, he's... Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm going to die. Just move, you fool. Come on, you can do it. Come on, come on, come on. Focus, focus, just focus. Why is it hitting me? Oh. Oh, no. Oh, God. I gotta focus. No. I'm so dead. I'm super dead. I'm so dead. I'm so freaking dead. Hey, the rolling is. I know I'm not invincible during the rolling. I gotta, gotta focus. Ah! Oh! Oh! 
Did I game over? What? Dude. Oh my god, we killed each other. Oh my god, dude. It restarted the level. Uh, it's a cursed item. Randomly increase or, de or decrease your mana cost, damage, critical chance, or knockback. Okay, so I got more damage. I got less attack speed. My knockback went up. Oh, hey, well, I think overall that was pretty good, though. More damage. That's fine. That sucked. That was terrible. Oh. Oh. Yeah. I, I, I tried rolling, but I don't have, like, a... You don't get iframes. You don't get iframes from rolling into projectiles. That's what I was banking on. But I didn't notice. Oh, that sucks, huh? I almost... Dude, I killed him. We killed each other at the exact same time. Okay, I'm just going to run through it. Because I can definitely kill him now. I definitely kill him now. Oh, that's upside. Sorry, that's not. Oh. I mean, that's what roguelites are, man. You live and you learn and you go again. Well, you die and go again. Live and learn. Hanging on the edge of tomorrow. Yeah, my, my rapid fire was no bueno there, though. Or my my boomerang for the Sansus wasn't able to get good DPS, and when he was in the the easiest mode, when he was throwing presents on the ground, that was the easiest dodge. Just stay still and hit him. Okay, hopefully we get a new weapon here. Let's see. Sapphire necklace, mana potions heal twice as much. Hmm. I kind of want the potion one, not the mana one. <laughs> Uh, the potion one was great. That, I think that would definitely help me live a couple of times already. Yeah. So I died and it just sent me back here. It didn't send me to the, the main area. Or maybe it bugged out because I killed, the go I killed the boss at the same time. If it just sent me straight back to the beginning of the stage, I think that's weird. It should send you back to the like the the main hub. Shorts, <gasps> short sword, spiked armor, green book, and magic gloves. These are all accessories, and they're new. I would like to definitely try them. Uh, I might as well try this. Hey, wait! It's the same weapon. Oh wait, it says eight, fifty, eight and fifty, ten and thirty-four. So it's faster. It's just faster. I can get two shots in. What the hell? It has low. How does a dagger have lower crit rate? How does a dagger have lower crit rate? What the hell, dude? I think that would be the, one of the main draws of the weapon. The only reason you want to use this is for the double attack speed. But then I like the the damage. It's it's pretty much less DPS. It's less DPS. Overall, because this one has better crit rate. Uh, the regular sword. Right? It's weird. Alright, but that guy's got a lot of accessories. Let's see it. What up, homies? Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, oh, God, dude. Let me try it. Let me, let me let me leave one, and then we'll try the invincible iframes. Now that's such a trap. If you have a roll, but it doesn't give you iframes, what's the point of rolling then, huh? Or maybe I have only a roll during a certain part of the frames? Or, yeah. Oh my god, I can't. I hate these enemies. Alright, let me try this. Okay. See, I got hit rolling into it. Oh, it's such a trap. Do I just never roll then? Because that sucks. Maybe at the very tail end or at the beginning of the roll. It's got... If, if there is a window... I don't know what it is. I have to just assume it's not there. Because I haven't been able to pull it off. But maybe someone else can do it. Uh, so yeah, I'll just leave it as it is. Uh, no rolling for me. Why would you want to roll? Oh. I'll buy one of you guys soon. I might end up uh, going through the whole stage. Ooh, that's a big chest. See, give, give me a bunch of slimes to fight. These guys are easy peasy. Money bags doubles your money if it's positive. Pays any negative money if it's negative. 
gives 500 money if you don't have any. Huh? Double your money if it's positive. Pay any negative if it's negative. I don't understand. I got 500 bucks though. I can buy all those items in that other room. What a weird item. All right, give me, give me an uh, easy room though. Give me some, uh, some stuff here. I need to find a magical weapon, man. I need a long range one, like a, a quick long range. All right, here we go. Fist it up. Give me the fist. But the more mana you have, the more mana region. So pretty much you want to um, keep your mana up and go in spurts for that item to be effective. Recovers mana when being damaged. Has a 60% chance of dealing damage whenever taking damage. So thorns. Okay. Nothing particularly too crazy there. But uh, I was able to buy everything with my Mooney. <laughs> with my Mooney. More slimes. I like it. I need a magical weapon, please. I like how enemies have a chance to drop biome specific weapons. I'm just assuming because it's a bunch of been a bunch of ice stuff and snowman things. It just makes sense, you know? Just makes sense. Multiple shops here. Another it's a teleport bed. That'd be cool if the bed was a, a full heal station. That'd be sweet. Oh damn it. Here we go again. Oh, this room sucks. Mm. I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh, I might die. I have to DPS them. I'm gonna die. Yeah, I'm gonna die here. Oh, you don't have iframes, dude. I didn't have iframes. This stupid. This dove. How does rolling not give you iframes? Ah. <laughs> All right. I'm going to end this little episode here. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like. It helps a lot. If you have any sub for daily videos, I'm going to keep playing. So stay tuned for part two. I'll probably put on the same day. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.